It truly is a whole new world at Camp Putnam, a peaceful, picturesque wooded area at the end of a dirt road in New Braintree. Heather and Duncan Stewart, who run the camp, first came as counselors 30 years ago. Founded by the Worcester Fresh Air Fund back in 1947, Camp Putnam's goal is to bring a changing environment to inner city children aged 6 through 12. Uh, during the day, they do fishing and frogging, pond life, nature crafts, arts and crafts, boating and canoeing, bicycling, hiking, uh, just all kinds of outdoor activities. How does a family get involved with Camp Putnam? Well, it's open enrollment. Anyone can apply. And we sent out the applications directly from here at the camp. Uh, people want to get requests in for applications early, probably March or April, because we do fill up in as, as early as June 1st. We're, we're full for the summer. But it's open to anyone. We cater primarily to, to folks who couldn't afford to send their kids to other camps. Uh, we're based on a sliding scale. And if your child receives free or reduced lunch at school, then it's $50 for the six-day session. And then it goes on up from there to $250 for a full session. There are several camp sessions each summer. Busloads of between 75 and 90 children arrive Sunday evening and head back home the following Friday. Singing is definitely a favorite activity, especially when cameras are rolling. Camp Putnam serves as a big confidence builder for the children, many of whom, being from cities, have never learned to ride a bike or swim. Camp Putnam, which celebrates a 50th anniversary next summer, has become a kind of family camp where generations have been able to enjoy and share a special summer experience. I understand that you have some relatives that came here as well. Who are they? My mother and my two aunts. Do they have a good time? Yes. Is that part of the reason you're here? Yes, my mom wanted me to enjoy the time that she had. Cooling off in the refreshing water is an extremely popular activity when the weather is so hot. Except for poor Kelsey, the camp dog, who's not allowed to join the kids in the water. Supervision is all important at Camp Putnam. There are 40 counselors and head counts are taken every few minutes but the kids don't seem to mind. In fact, the only thing they seem to mind is going home. I would have joined the kids in the water, but I wasn't allowed in either. Well, this year, for the first time, Camp Putnam received a grant from the Worcester Housing Authority of more than $3,800 so that 13 kids from Great Brook Valley could go to camp. I hope you